hello and welcome to another video today we will briefly look at how you can calculate uh the number of pips uh that priced has moved for forex uh example great britain pounds versus us dollar gbp usd i have gbp usd on the chart and i want to calculate the amount of pips uh, from the blue line blue horizontal line to the red horizontal line I want to calculate the amount of pips from uh, this blue line the blue line I have 1.40000 all right and the red line is 1.39000 so I want to know the amount of pips that price has done for this uh, uh, price movement. Okay, so what I'll basically do is to go to my Excel sheet. Uh, go to my Excel sheet. I have the 1.400 here. I have the 1.3900 here. So what I'll basically do is have a formula I use okay this is the formula the 1.4 subtracted by the 1.39 times 10,000 uh, units all right don't forget the 1.4 minus the 1.39 times 10,000 so that's my excel calculator and the answer is 100 so that will be 100 pips the implication is that if price moves from 1.40 down to 1.3900 price will have done 100 pips movement okay but let's say we want to calculate 1.395 all right to 1.39 still the same calculation 1.395 which is my h10 minus 1.39 which is my h12 times 10,000 okay and the answer will be 50 pips so if price moved from 1.395 from here 1.395 somewhere around here price moves from somewhere around here 1.395 down to 1.39 that will have been 50 pips but if price moved from 1.4 area or exactly 1.4 area down to 1.39 that will have been 100 pips in line with the calculation okay so that's for a bearish movement what about bullish movement if price move from 1.39 to 1.4 it will still be the same amount of pips if price move from 1.39 to 1.4 it will still be 100 pips if price move from 1.4 to 1.39, it will still be 100 pips. Same thing with if price move from 1.395 to 1.3900, it will be 50 pips. And if price move from 1.3900 to 1.395, it is still the same 50 pips. Don't forget the calculation. Uh, 1.395 minus 1.39 times 10,000. That should give you the calculation. Then 1.4 minus 1.39 times 10,000. That should also give you the calculation. So that's that for how to calculate uh, the number of pips for GDP USD. You can use the same thing for uh, Euro USD. You can use the same thing for uh, AUD USD 
all right so that's that don't forget to subscribe to our channel click the subscription button so that you get to see other videos on how to calculate pips for other currencies then like our video click the bell button below the video for notification and also state your question if you are not clear state it below the video we'll try and clarify for you all right so you can also visit our website www.nfxtrader.com to learn more about how to calculate pips uh, we also have another website fxfables.com so that come your way next time is bye for now